Your PFD is one of your most important pieces of paddling kit. So as spring comes around, here's our quick three-point health check to make sure yours is still in good working order. Over time, foam can degrade and lose volume and therefore buoyancy. A really simple visual check can be to see how tightly the foam fits inside the PFD's shell. If it's quite loose and there's a bit of spare fabric, this is a really good indicator that the foam has shrunk. Alternatively, you can do a simple float test to find out how. Click on the link below or on this video here. The second thing to look out for is UV damage, that sun bleached faded look. You should be aware that UV damage will also greatly reduce the strength of the materials. Find a bit of the PFD which hasn't been exposed to sunlight and try and find out what colour it used to be. Another obvious thing to look out for are the buckles and the webbing. Pay special attention to the shoulders and the waist. If someone's pulling you out of the water, the last thing you need is for a buckle or piece of webbing to fail because it was worn out or damaged. One last thing to look for is the presence of cobwebs on your PFD. If, like Pete's here, it's been left in an abandoned jungle temple for a thousand years and then discovered by an archaeologist, the chances are it belongs in a museum. If treated well, a PFD will last for several years. However, it's good to check occasionally to make sure it's still safe to use.